What you want, boy? Oh. Oh. He had a chance. He picked. Oh, epic. I'm sorry. Shit, that's an e pick. Welcome to the stream. Oh. Ooh, come on. Ah, get the fuck out of here, man. Come on. Ali's got a way of just getting away from that punch. Do what you're doing. Here the facts. You can choose from a number of health care that's a long ass round. Those with pre existing conditions. To get the facts on plan costs and best combination in the game, jab with the straight. Alabama Blue.com slash radio. Blue Cross and Blue Shield of Alabama. We cover what matters. Now committing to that jab, straight hand, and it works out. Come on, let me, let me go. But it's something that needs to be monitored. A very crisp combination by Eddie Chambers. Eddie Chambers is just punching air that time. His opponent was able to get out of the way. He got hit right there, but he also gave one. Solid effort by Muhammad Ali. Ah. If you have Comes right back at him with a left hand. Eddie Chambers is missing the mark by yeah, the come on. That just was nowhere to be found. 90 seconds to go here in this round. Ah. Too early. I gotta get my timing back. Because that left hand has been scoring too consistently. Exactly, Joe. And there's nothing else that he really has to worry about. Take that out of the equation, he'd be winning the fight. <laughs> ah! Man, look at him blood. That blood on my shorts. his ass up. I'm supposed to tow his ass up with that one. 
a good time to come here to this venue. You take great fans. I mean, wherever we go on our fight night tour, we have great fans. Yeah, passionate fans, fans that know the fighters and care about the sport. Basic but beautiful. Jab, left hand. What's up, Kifa? That's great stuff. He oh, oh, I was supposed to knock his ass out. Got to love the work oh, by oh, Muhammad oh. Ali. Come on, kid, focus. Good one, too, by Muhammad Ali. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. Damn. I shake it off. Woo. Open dope, come on. Bring some more. Big left hand. Yes, sir. Uh, get your head down. Oh, and there you go. Great Let's go. Off me. Well targeted two punch combo by Eddie Chambers. Takes one but gets one. Good work by Muhammad Ali. Muhammad Ali's got that catch me if you can kind of attitude. He's almost daring his opponent at this point to try to land a headshot. Yeah. But his movement's been so good. His defense is just free. Yeah, it is. He's moving from the waist. He's slipping the straight shots. He's weaving the hooks. He's doing a real magical job in there. But his opponent is making no adjustments at all. Just did a big uppercut. He's in bad shape. Ali's there it is. He goes down. It's like he was thrown into a blender of punches. Ooh. <laughs> oh shit. Eddie Chambers is showing you what he is made of getting up off the canvas after being knocked down. Not the most accurate uppercut Ooh. you'll see. Oh, keep your distance. Action body. Mm-hmm. Come on. Ali's hand speed is right now the difference. Teddy. Boom. Left hand comes off. Yeah. Over. That is boxing 101. Wow. Muhammad Ali's opponent is floored. A knockout victory. Boy, was that impressive. Mm. <clears throat> he just couldn't fight no more. I fucked his eyes up. Uh, hmm. Trying to see. Yeah, I fucked his eyes up. He can't really do much. Well, that's why he got the TKO, Joe, because he was in control. He was doing the right things, and it led to this. I'm Joe Tessator for Teddy Atlas saying thanks for being with us, and enjoy the rest of your night. This definitely makes me want to get better.
Definitely wants to make makes me want to get better though. Dirty Ducky, what's good? Thanks, bro. They 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 uh they ain't for sure. They real glasses, man. Long time no see though, Dirty Ducky. They real glasses, dog. They don't bands though, but they real. Oh, do we have frogs? Well, I, I, I used to love dropping them bombs. I mean, he used to beat a nigga down. On, uh... When, you, when you're trying to beat this game, it's the most frustrating thing in the world, man. Trying to beat this game. Especially when you're playing Frost. Hmm. You crazy. Thanks, y'all, man. I'm glad y'all like the glasses because they, they, they here to stay because my ass can't see. That's what the doctor said. Your ass can't see. Cairo, no, no fleet. <laughs> no fleet. But I am finna box this dude out, though. Gundam, welcome back. Like you look at the game I was playing earlier, video games and came a long way, brother. A long way. I'm about to whip his ass though. We went over the rules in the dressing room. Let's have a good clean fight. Everybody's been waiting for these two to meet up. Now they do as round Ice cold, baby. Solid left hand to the head. We are underway here, and we've heard from everybody that Damn. speed is going to be the big factor. Frost, oh. plenty of it. Yeah, now it's up to his opponent to come up with something. Maybe go to the body, take it away, slow him down. He's a puncher, man. Come on. I'm the guy in the blue trunks, if didn't nobody know. Damn, he's slow. Isaac's slow as fuck. Big George Foreman oh. unloads a left hand. Another huge shot comes in early on in this fight from him. Well, he understood that his opponent, Joe, was a slow starter. He's jumping right on him, taking advantage. Foreman's punch is far off the target. Good step back, counter punch there. Beautiful. You better get your head back, I'm gonna knock your ass out. Mm. Oh shit. I'm so slow. Oh man. Good looking uppercut that time. Oh, come on. 
burly, dangerous Isaac Frost with a strong combination. In and out. Kenny, we've seen both these guys before, and we have a feeling, just kind of have the feeling that it could be one of those special nights. Yeah, because uh. styles, it suits up for one of those special nights. Isaac Frost knows how to do everything in the ring, but throwing a right hand like that, that's one of his specialties. Ah. Needs to improve that accuracy. Missed with the head shot. Ah. I need our lead back, man. Woo. So many times you hear of an early round where they're just feeling each other out. No way. Not these guys. Straight to action. Well, yeah. Up, Come on. Headaches, All right. Oh, I can't believe I missed that. A well targeted jam that time. Damn, he got me. Final ten seconds of round number one. Let's go. Gundam, thanks for the follow, man. Thanks for the follow. You're a scholar and a gentleman, bro. And I appreciate it. Uh, I think I got like 370, man. I'm, I'm trying to get to 400. I got like right at 370. Shit. I probably shouldn't have went with uh, Frost. He's so slow. Oh. Shit. He's trying to take me out. Yeah. Motherfucker. Well, I don't know if he's hip to the idea of becoming a counterpuncher, but I get the sense you'd agree with it. Yeah, definitely. I mean, he's got the perfect platform, the perfect form for it. The guy's walking in right now, not moving his head much. He can time him, he can counter him. Ah, I got his head. Enjoy us up. Woo! Yeah! Isaac Frost proving to be elusive. Ah. Isaac Frost able to land a nice, clean left hand. A little head hunting with the right. Damn. He fucking me up. Not able to land the head shot. Halfway through round number two. And who hit? He That's took uh, a shot, but he gives one of his own. A left hand scores. Scored well up top. Good exchange. He fires back. Yeah. I'm, I'm popping the shit out of top of his head. Little volume punching to the body there. Yeah. Well, that was his ah, he's just going to start grabbing. Ah, oh, not the battery pack out. Shit. Yes, it is, and specifically what it is, is he has good fundamentals. He keeps those hands up real good, you know. He'll attach, they're up around his chin, his elbows in. You know, he has a real shell there that's not easy to penetrate. And now a little combination punching, landing both shots. Oh, how did I miss? What a skilled fighter he is with this counter punching. Great deals on Ram 1500. One, two, one, two. Guts, slurs, Ram. 
EPA estimated 20 in the highway based on available Eagle Diesel V6 4 by 2 10 seconds remaining in this round. Go ahead, back. Making predictions in boxing is often a dangerous task, but I'll make one right here that seems pretty obvious to me as we come to the end of that round here. <laughs> this fight is going to be a brutal display as long as it lasts. It's kind of like going and watching that home run contest. Nobody's trying to hit singles or doubles. You know they're all going for the fences. Keep the jam pumping and throw the lead right here, right? You are winning this fight. Here you go. Okay. Another round, and if it keeps up with the rest of them, it'll be Ooh, he tried to knock me out. He go off to the side, a little swing and miss going upstairs. Cross jab on the outside. That has really been the difference maker here, hasn't it, Ted? Yes, it has. But the most important thing is, you know, everybody says, hey, just use your jab, you control the outside. Hey, jab's a great weapon, but it could be very dangerous. You throw it from a little too close, you could get counted with that right hand. He's throwing it at the perfect distance, getting full extension on yeah. that one. Oh. Damn, I suppose knocked him out. Big, big shot. Woo! He goes down, down Cairo. You wanted to knock out? You want to knock out? There you go, a knockout. Knock him out. <laughs> you wanted a knockout, there you go. Oh, get off me, man. Oh. His opponent likes to tone of him. Good, solid. Solid. How about that power shot? And how about the. You see that? That's going about a county away with the George hitting the canvas. You see the three hit combo when I tap, tap, tap? I love that shit. Tap, tap, tap. Just a little quick. Oh, he ain't getting up. He ain't getting up. Follow T was good. Well, follow photo T was good, bro. That shit was tough. <laughs> we won't get up from now. Welcome back, bro. Movement. I'm gonna go, Isaac. Is he heavy? Like? Butterbean's a pretty good boxer. I know it don't it don't say he's he's high, but uh, I usually have a tough time beating Butterbean because of the way he fight. He just keep rushing, and I and I have a hard time fighting guys like that. Smoking great, it's like a 17 again, peach fuzz. 
Butter Bean's a good ass boxer, man. He always pull out like those improbable victories. Oh. Hi, everybody. So glad you're with us. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and we welcome you to Boardwalk Hall as a famed Atlantic City He's 44 years in old. Southern New Jersey. Our main event should be a good one tonight. Four rounds of... Let's get this shit over with. Get a fight like this that everybody's been talking about. It's always so interesting to see these opening moments here in round number one. Scores well to the head with the right hand. It's so slow. It's just all power. Is this the type of matchup that you like oh. when you had a power puncher facing another power puncher? All right, no, all right, bro, move it. We'll be here. I wanted to be the only guy in that ring that brought that to the party. He tried to nab him up top, but was unable to connect. Damn. Well, supposed to be fighting. Woo! Get off me. Yeah, he, he keep running up on me swinging. Oh, come on, let's go. He want to keep coming. See, just keep rushing. Look at the little subtleties here, Joe. What he does is he forces him into a position to stop the punch, and then when he stops, steps back, makes a miss, and comes right back. Body shot, body shot. And now he's got to be just, careful. Oh, he's been warned for the head body. I ain't trying to headbutt him. Get off here. Oh, I could have knocked him out. Oh shit! The combination by Isaac Frost right there, the jab and then the straight hand. And now he's acting like a fighter, coming back with the right hand after getting scored upon. Keeps his hands up defensively, protecting the head. Damn. Teddy, I'm gonna call this one a little baking soda and vinegar matchup. You know what happens when you put those two things together? Yeah, you get a volcano and it's gonna explode. And I think before the night's over, you're gonna see that. Oh, he gonna knock me out. Shit. Red hot action to open up this fight. Both men throwing, both men landing. It's been a long time since I've seen something like this. I think it was in a film like Remy. Watchman. He is not in good yeah. shape. He could be on the deck in moments. Big shot. Oh, this is gonna be close. He may be yeah. able to survive the round, but he has gone down now. <laughs> What'd you say? It's T. It's Beatty. It's not gonna fat nigga. <laughs> But the advice I would give him is, hey, you go out this next round and you kill some time. Tie him up a little bit right from the beginning. Don't worry about losing the early part of the fight or the early part of the round. Just get yourself back together. Okay. How, how is... Okay. They be cheating for the computer, too. Because this stamina is supposed... All the power punches he threw. Ooh. That 60 seconds has been okay. enough for fighters in his position before. The sport's been around way over 100 years. It's up to him to do the things he needs to do early on in this round. Butterbean's lacking that jab there. He just hasn't committed to throwing it at all. I mean, that's the most basic thing in the world is to use that jab. That jab does so many things for you. It keeps the guy defensive, and obviously it sets up your offense. Looks to the head. Damn. Now hugging on the inside. Get off me. He 
he's starting to gain some. Oh, he is stuck. Oh. He could go down. Oh, he's hurt right there. He is hurt. You know, his opponent's doing a good job of just being patient now and looking for that one good shot. Wait, well, good block. The landscape of this business, the history of this business is littered with guys that they've had someone hurt, they get a little careless, they get caught. You better watch out that he doesn't get put on that landscape. Oh. Good blocking. Damn, I can't get him down. He got hella good defense. Get him off. Get him off me. Able to get away from that headshot with the block. Wow! Can he get up? Dropped his ass. Too much. Can he get up from a second time now? And that does it. Is it unable to beat the count of ten? A knockout in the books. Yeah, I got a mustache. Official particular. We send it up to our ring announcer. I just kind of uh, keep it shaved down. Exactly what fans are always looking for. It's kind of like walking into a room and there's somebody hitting behind the door and they hit you on the head. You're going to go out cold because you don't have time to register it. You don't have time to prepare and race for it. He never saw this coming. Out of the blue. For Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. Thanks for being with us, Ringside. I'm, no, I'm trying to find a, a real good fight for him. Somebody's going to go to distance. Oh yeah, my boxing. <laughs> I made him retire too early though, so that's why he's not that good. No, I made a mistake and made him retire. I, I ain't even try to do it, and it saves as soon as you did it. So you know we got a chance to be real, real like a legend. Guys, make sure y'all check out some of the YouTube videos. It's right below the stream. And after this, I'll reshow everybody the the new intro did that I got. I created. I don't know. I'll just mess it around today. I don't know if I use it or not. But this should be a good one tonight. Both fighters say they are fried. Mike Tyson. Shit. He's got his guard up really well that time and protects his head. 
Teddy, talk to me about this matchup from a defensive side of the game when you have two speedy fighters matching up. Well, you know what? I'm going to whisper my guy's ear a little bit. I'm going to say, you know what? Use his speed against him. Go ahead and back. Step out a little bit. Let him shadow box a little bit. There's nobody there. And when he misses, step right back in. Make him pay. That's a well-scored left hand by Mike Tyson. Iron Mike with a big Shit. uppercut. I can't take too many of them punches. Really wanted that uppercut, but just couldn't get it. Oh, I can't believe I missed it. I thought for sure I was gonna get him. Digging in with a left to the gut. Damn, back up. Watch out. Huge right hand from Mike Tyson. I can't get back. And he just holds Oh, get off me. Ross getting himself into the mix now, landing that left hand. Shit. He brings an uppercut that really does damage there. Rock him, sock him, robots right from the start here, Teddy. No defense, just pure Sorry, offense. I'll make it fast. Really fast. Charter Spectrum Internet is so fast, Ooh. it has speeds that start at 60 megabits per second. That's 20 times faster than DSL. Not oh. able to connect with the uppercut. If there's one thing Isaac Frost can do is generate power. Boy, did he just deliver some power with that uppercut. Oh, you see him with the left of the head there? Oh, knockout! Oh, ho, ho! Oh, wow. Knocked him out first round. Mike Tyson. <laughs> yeah. He came out swinging too hard. I'm pretty good at this game, though. I'm pretty decent. Not all the way. Yeah, we're getting a peek right now into his heart, into his soul. And he ties up Get off of me. Side. Get off of him. I'll let him go. What the hell? He's strong. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Tyson with a powerful left hand. Isaac Frost isn't a one punch at a time kind of guy. He will throw combinations like that. Last 10 seconds of this first round. Great work by Isaac Frost. Too many of those punches by Isaac Frost. Eh. And this night's going to be over. Round comes to an end here. An enjoyable night sitting ringside. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas. A lot better than our day we spent at the horse track the other day where we couldn't get any. How the hell he recovered just as much as me? But I knocked him out. So many I knocked him down. Between boxing and light boxing and all these other sports we enjoy, like horse racing, of being well conditioned and working your way up to this one singular moment. Here was a trainer. Obviously, you oh. have to get the athlete. In this case, the athlete has to be over a thousand pounds, and that's a horse. You know, at peak condition, he has to look at a counter just like a trainer does with a fighter. Know when the race is, oh, the yeah. fight is, and not get used up out on the track or used Ooh. up, of course, in the gym. Mike Tyson is going out there after just being knocked down in the last round. If you're standing opposite him, what's the mentality? What's the strategy? Well, you want to uh. go after him, but you don't want to walk into a trap either. You want to kind of size him up a little bit. You want to see if he looks like... Damn, I keep knocking the damn batter out of control. That he might be trying to con you. You know you're oh, trying to throw so that put shit. that pressure on, but do it smart. And now he brings the left hand upstairs. A thudding blow by Isaac Ross. This heavyweight champ lets you know you're in a fight. Not much action ah. as he just ties up. Good combination by Isaac Frost right there. The jab and then the straight hand. 
Ah, I tried to finish him. Right to the head with that right. The old one two scores for him. Reaching the halfway mark of this round. Teddy, there are opportunities that are here for him, aren't there? Yeah, counterpart oh. opportunities because you've got an opponent who's walking in a little bit. Now he has a chance to start to chuck something back at him a little. Good shot to the head with that right hand. Hard to believe they can still give like this in these final moments of what has been a sensational round. I feel like I'm back at the amusement park on a roller coaster again, like a kid. Now he ties up there. Ah, oh, he should have came up with that damn one because I stopped it. on the outside here in this fight. Tyson's showing you a little yeah. defensive skill there. I will move away from that punch. Oh, and they decide to trade there. Just 10 seconds to go here in the second round. Oh, he took some damage, but he gave some back with the right hand. Damn. Welcome back, Carol. Good action throughout. We'll see if it keeps up in this round of what has been a very even fight. Get off of me. Ah, oh, come on. Frost doing well here with that two punch combination. Sizzling hand speed we saw moments ago. Heck of a combination, but uh, pretty easy to get it off when you're that fast. Yeah, it is. And what it causes, too, is besides us saying, ooh, ooh, that we see those quick hands in the judges, you know, marking it down. Oh, yes, sir. Get your ass on the floor. Yes, sir. Uh... Firing off the uppercut. Great exchange. Good left hand by Frost. He missed with that headshot. Oh, damn. He's supposed to knock out. Stop. You can make him do what you want. He made him tie his shoelaces like that. Mike Tyson's inconsistencies are really showing up now. At times, he has shown defense tonight. Other times, with what we've seen recently, he's getting hit by the left hand. Yeah, what he has to do is now... Oh, that was it. Left hand came after the he jab. over right up to it, too. Let me back the fuck up.
just misses with that headshot. Oh, I tried to knock his ass out. Yeah, one more. Last round, I just got to get through this. How the hell did he recover 7%? He was on the floor. Deep breath, stay with me. You have to do more to win this fight. Listen, you need to move. Bullshit. Round number four, the last go round for these two is underway. Frost in a good rhythm defensively here. Teddy, what is that, a credit to his ability to anticipate? You know, also, it's the teaching. Let's give the trainers credit. Of course, let's give his background of the amateurs credit, but he learned how to get away from punches. This is technique that was taught to him. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Mike Tyson turned oh, that good. hook in well. Combo lands to the head. Oh, he just fell out. He just fell out. He couldn't go no more. One punch power ends the evening. You gotta love that. He couldn't go no more. Oh, that was it. That was just nasty. The mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Four. up on your scorecard throughout the evening. Isaac Frost now a winner by knockout. Listen, you want to win, you want to get to a title. You want to be successful. We want to make money. And this is one way. He went down. He went down hard too. Let me see. Look, I'm gonna play with my creator, dude. If you wanna see me lose a match, this is gonna be one I'm gonna lose. I guess he found a hold of fear. There's no way I can win this fight. being entered into the Indianapolis huh. 500. That's a forceful two punch Sage, Sage of the, the Libra. Welcome to the stream. That is a sharp uppercut by Dollar Bill. You've trained opposite of Andrew Holyfield and defeated him. But if you were in his corner, your advice to him facing a counterpuncher would be? Well, oh, probably faint a little bit before you walk in because he's going to look to beat you to the mark. He's going to look to catch you coming in. And also, obviously, you know, be solid technically. He's Shit. a good technical fighter, Holyfield, besides being a beast of a man, besides being the warrior that he is. You know, make sure that 
when you're throwing it at the guy, don't leave anything to be done. Uh. You know, move after your last punch. You know, because that's really... He's a, my man's so slow. Makes his liver. You know, he'll make you miss. Say he's to leave, welcome to the show. And he'll come back and he'll touch you. Pulls the trigger right away with the left hand after getting tagged himself. I hit him. And Shit. coming upon the halfway mark of this three-minute round. Shit. Good right hand. Ooh. By Dollar Bill. Took a step back. He damn near knocked me out. Exactly what he wanted to do. Good defensive guard now by Evander Holyfield. It's all right. Keep moving. That worked out really well. Oh. Throwing off the right hand after getting tagged like that. Gets rid of that. It was intended for his head. Well targeted right hand by Evander Holyfield. Now his opponent got away from that uppercut. Good defense upstairs to stay away from that offensive assault. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Evander. Uh, I can't move. I'm so slow. Uh, I can't get out of the way. I'm too slow. Woo. Oh, come on. We got to knock him down with that one. And clicks of the top. You better. Accurate shot. Straight right hand comes in. Ooh. I gave him one. I gotta be feeling. And we are back on the can't win this. in which he can take his opponent's aggression and turn it against him? Yeah, the perfect way. I mean, boxing 101, counter punching. You got a guy coming at you, no better way than to change his mind. Make him miss, make him pay. Ah. Uh. Oh. Right hand. Oh. Shot. Now he gives the left. A well placed gutsy uppercut after being tagged. And now he's targeting upstairs. Right hand from Holy. Oh, come on. Lewis is showing you what it takes to be the best in this business. Good, crisp combos. Halfway through this round here. Shit, he beat my ass. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. Evander Holyfield's jab continues to carry the day. He's wanted it, he's got it. You can see he's trying to score up top, but off the mark there. Little head hunting. Oh. Oh. Damn! Dollar bill. Oh, I'm starting again. Shit! He don't have no. He don't have no stamina at all. To be in this fight. 
Good smooth work by Evander oh. Holyfield. That's classic counter punching. Yeah, what he did was he pulled that right shoulder back. You know, he just pulled it back, Damn. gave him the left shoulder, and then smooth, gave him the right hand. Supposed to last just four minutes, but in the moment of inspiration. Damn, come on, he about to slam you. Ain't Final ten seconds of round number two. Of a dream. And now that speech echoes in our hearts forever. Hits him in the mug with the right. Celebrating the legacy of Dr. Holyfield's able to land a good, solid left hand. That is it. That's it. And be your moment of inspiration. Lewis is in a tough spot here. 60 seconds. That's all you get to gather yourself after being knocked down. Good doubling up of the jab by Evander Holyfield. See what you think I'm doing. Goes up top with the right hand. Nice block oh. by Lewis. Solid hook upstairs. If there was a baseball umpire around, he'd call that a strikeout by Dollar Bill. Oh. Lewis is basically doing exactly what we've always seen out of him, and that's after he's been knocked out and affected in this fight. Yeah, you know, there comes a time you have to make a judgment. That time has come for him. Blocked by Shit. Holyfield. Coming to the halfway point of this third round. Holyfield's knowledge of the game is showing through. Three ways to defend. One of them is the block. He did it there well. Good clean shot returning fire. Well done by Dollar Bill. And here they go again. Just on a blistering pace. Punch for punch being met by the opponent. Push a human being into the abyss. To a place that's dangerous, that's scary. Either they give in, they fall deeper, or they come out. Oh. Both these guys are coming out. Come on. Damn, my dude look terrible. And oh, what a good, strong uppercut by a oh. holy field. Oh. Doubling up the jab by a Vander Holyfield. He clinches when he gets to the His ass supposed to be knocked out. Might as well use that hand speed. No better way to use it than putting them together. Not hitting his mark there going upstairs. Lewis is putting his punches together now. That's a nice combination. Holyfield with a huge left. Oh. 
was unable to land it. Come on. Great work offensively landing that combination by Lewis. My punches ain't strong enough. Uh. Mm. Ain't strong enough. Uh. Just as importantly, you handcuff yourself so your opponent is going to stay in there a little bit more, oh. than knowing that nothing's coming back right away. Damn. Targeting each other, the exchange was something special. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. Oh, that's good stuff. Fired right back with one of his own. Good work by a uh, holy fear. He got away. I say it all the time. You never know what you're going to get in this sport. We never thought this fight would go this Oh, uh, early on, it looked like Frazier Ali. I mean, the thrill in Manila. Who thought we'd wind up with a little ballet down the stretch? Ah. Uh. This was a sure and steady effort by Evander Holyfield tonight. And it earns him a unanimous decision win. Teddy, your scorecard reflects that as well. Yeah, I don't think it was ever a question of uh, who was going to win. It was how. Was it going to be knockout or unanimous decision? All right. He got it the right way. That was Teddy cool. Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. Have yourself a great evening. All right, guys, I'm going to get up out of here, man. Thanks, everybody, for uh, stopping through. I'll catch y'all tomorrow, man. Um, once again, I'm Photo T, and that's Fight Night 4. Street Fighter and all that good biz, man. Thanks for coming through. Thanks for all the follows. I'll catch y'all tomorrow. Peace. Beats, holla at me.